First at 11, our nation's capital on high alert tonight. The FBI warning of a possible domestic terror attack tomorrow. Good evening, I'm Elliot Rodriguez. I'm Lauren Pastrana. The warning is specific, saying groups that stormed the Capitol two months ago are planning to do so again. The intelligence bulletin also says Democratic lawmakers may be targeted. CBS 4's Natalie Brand is in Washington with our top story at 11. Threats to the Capitol prompted House Democrats to move up a vote on a policing reform bill named in honor of George Floyd to Wednesday night. The House canceled votes on Thursday following revelations of a new FBI and Department of Homeland Security bulletin, which warns of more violence with little or no warning. The threat is driven by a QAnon conspiracy theory that former President Trump will be inaugurated Thursday, March 4th. We are working with our law enforcement partners as well as the National Guard to provide a robust security posture around the campus. U.S. Capitol Police say they're prepared for any potential threats towards the Capitol complex or members of Congress. In the first two months of 2021, there has been over a 93% increase in the threats to members compared to the same period last year. The new bulletin obtained by CBS News mentions militia plans to take control of the U.S. Capitol and remove Democratic lawmakers. The alert comes as intelligence officials testified on Capitol Hill Wednesday, telling senators the January 6th assault could embolden others. What message do you believe this is sending to other domestic violent extremists, let alone foreign adversaries. Anytime an adversary is successful, others pay attention. And so we're worried that this would be an inspiration. Well, I think the I think President Trump has a responsibility to tell them to stand down. Texas Republican Michael McCall said the threat is credible as Capitol Police call on law enforcement partners throughout the nation's capital in preparation for possible unrest this week. Natalie Brand, CBS News, Washington.